Well, we love our viewers here on Sonoran Living. We love to talk with you on Facebook and on our website. And this is the week of the viewer because we've had viewers come on our show yep. who've, who've sent us emails. And you are blinging. And one of your favorite things is, of course, the craft queen when she <laughs> does her thing. And one of our viewers, Joy, she wrote and she says, I would love to know how to bling up jeans instead of paying big bucks for pants uh, that have bling on the pockets and how you can add permanent decorative hip designs to the back pocket. She went on to say that she's went to a lot of websites but they're so expensive. They are. It's they expensive are. to do this. So you answered Joy's call. So Joy, I'm going to hook you up. Okay, <laughs> first of all, Joy, one of your questions was, um, where do you find them? And I have a picture. I was actually at Joanne's Fabric Store yesterday, and this is one wall. Wow. Okay, there are two walls of bling. This is just one kind. These are the iron-ons. So Joy, head to your local craft store. Michael's has them, Hobby Lobby has them, uh, Joanne's has them, so, okay? So, but here's what I wanna show you, Susan. I came up with a bunch of different ways to bling your jeans, depending on how much money you wanna spend and whether or not you wanna buy tools, okay? So first of all, this right here, this pair of jeans that I have, um, and all this is is a fabric applique. It's actually for a wedding dress. Oh. And I went to that one store, it's called SAS, where you buy fabric, like buy the pound, mm -hmm. <laughs> or pieces like 25 cents a piece, and I picked up all these appliques okay but I didn't like the white white on mm -hmm. the jeans so you know what I did I stained them I put them in a jar of coffee Wow. All right. This is like heavy, thick, super dark, dark, do not drink this kind of coffee. <laughs> and if you put one of your appliques in it, let it soak for a couple hours, it will absorb the color. These were pure white. It will That's absorb beautiful. the color and then you can add it to your jeans. So here's what I did. I used fabric fusion glue. And let me tell you something. It's dry cleanable. It, it, it sticks. It will not come off. <laughs> Trust me on this one because I wanted to change it out and I'm like trying to oh. pull it off and I couldn't. So this will become permanent. Okay. But how super simple is that? And how long do we keep it in the coffee? You know what? I just kept it in for like a half an hour. Not yeah. even that. Yeah. Wow. And took it out and let it dry and then and then ironed it. So here's what we can do. We can add it. These are your jeans. Yeah. Here, so we, we brought can, in jeans. Look at how them. cute that is to that add is to the bottom cute. of the jeans. And then, so that's one technique. Here's the other technique. These are your jeans, Susan. Mm -hmm. You gave them to me. Mm -hmm. I added these to your jeans. So cute. I How haven't worn these in such a long time, and you're like bringing new life into my denim. So well, I appreciate that. I mean, because you know how when you go to the store and you get this one little embellishment, mm -hmm. how much extra it costs? Mm -hmm. so, so here's what these are. These are these right here. These are hot fix rhinestones and studs. And here's a little tip. So you can, this is a skewer and I put a little little hot glue to make a little ball on the end. This will help you um, pick up the studs and then you can place them wherever you want on your jean. And then what you're gonna do is use a tool like this to adhere it to the jean. And I, this is actually hot and I don't wanna place that on there right now because that's not where I want it. Mm -hmm. But you just take it and place them where you want them and then you hold that over it for about 15 seconds and there's glue underneath that stud, mm -hmm. and it melts the glue, and it adheres to the jean. Nice, and I can wash these and everything? You can wash them. What I recommend, though, and that's a question that Joy had, is what do we do after we bling? You turn them inside out, and do not put them in the dryer, because the heat from the dryer might activate the glue on the studs, uh, which you shouldn't do whether you make them yourself or yeah. buy them anyway, okay? okay? So that's one technique. The iron-on technique is really, really easy, too. And you can buy different types of... Um, like pre-designed embellishments, which is what I did here. These are Kim's jeans. I did these on the on the uh, pockets, these little wings. Oh, that's cute. And then over here, I decided to go around the pocket. Again, these are all iron-ons, okay? Nice. The front I did right here. These are these sheets, all these cool studs. But here's the thing that people always, you know, this is where it trips them up. You peel these off like this. Everything is stuck to this clear sheet. So with this, now I could just like put that there and it'd be like one straight line and kind of mm -hmm. silly. So I decided to take it and just kind of angle it on. This sticks on, it's sticky, and I'm just gonna use this tool right here. It's a flat bottom tool and it's super, super hot. And I'm just gonna place that on there and it melts the glue once again underneath the stud. And then when I peel it off, just those pieces that I've actually placed this little iron on, 
will stick. And it takes about, you know, 15, 20 seconds, and we, I don't know if we have the time and if it actually worked or not, but yeah, there you go. Wow. Okay, so I actually just kind of maneuvered this all over and placed it where I wanted and just put the little heating tool over those areas so that I created my own design. I love that. Well, Joy, I hope this has been a huge help for you. And I know <laughs> you are really taking notes, Jonathan, because <laughs> he said, I thought Terry was going to bling out my scooter. Well, I, I already added feathers. I, I don't know what else I can do. <laughs> and you were just on the phone. Say hi to your mom and dad. I know they're watching right now, hopefully. Oh, that's so Aww. awesome. Aww. That's awesome. What he I, stuck around. Well, what I can do, Jonathan, is do you like these studs? You know, like, see how I did the, the back of these rocking High heel shoes. Oh, yeah. Yes. Well, I can, I can add these studs to your boot. How about oh. that? You can. Love it. Sure. <laughs> Do you want me to? He's not going to say no to us today. Well, you know, he, he is a rookie. We're going we're gonna to really, <laughs> you talk about hazing. He's going to be hazed to death when he gets back. <laughs> hey, who better to train you than us? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> we love it. He's being so kind to us. When he leaves there, he's going to go, those ladies? Yeah, yeah. those Sonoran living. They're well, going to go back and we're going to go, we're going to have a little media talk. We love that. Jonathan. We love that. No, those we're gonna, girls. No, we're going to go to the Cardinals. No more Sonoran we're gonna living. We're going to out the Cardinals uniforms. That's what you're going to do next. I am? We'll Maybe be we calling have jerseys. you. <laughs> Well, I tell you what, hopefully, Joy, you got all of your questions answered, yep. and she's put this, you put this on our website. I put the instructions and washing instructions and all the different techniques on the website, SonoraLiving.com.